Hi and welcome back to my channel. In this video, let's talk about new features of ASP.NET Core 6 and the topic for today is CSS isolation. Let's create a new project and I'll call it uh, Web App 6 and I'm choosing .NET 6 Preview and I am also using the latest version of Visual Studio Preview so that's what you need usually you have a CSS file here or a couple of them and you add them to your layout and everywhere in your pages in your views you get the same style but sometimes you want to change the style for one page in particular so uh, for this demo i want to change the style of index page and privacy page using css isolation to use this feature let's add a new file i'm going to add a new empty file and call it privacy cs html dot css so i'm creating a css file and let's change the color of h1 tag to let's say purple and also let's change the color of paragraphs so this is the name I chose because I want this CSS style only to be used in this page and no other pages or no other views should be using this style. Before running the project and see the result, there is one last thing that you need to do. Let's go to layout and add a CSS reference to this address web app 6 dot styles dot css and we don't need the rest so because it's going to be generated in the background this is the file that later adds uh, adds on to your views and all the styles bundles into this one single file so let's run the project for now and see the results. So my project is up and running and you notice that for the index page there is no change in style. But if I go to my privacy page, you see the h1 tag is purple and the paragraph color is blue. And that is exactly what we chose in our code. And also let's see how it works i go to f12 or developer tools and let's refresh the page and uh, disabling the cache helps uh, with loading the all files and here you notice that there's a file called webapp6.style.css and here you can see the styles that i just uh, picked here and that's how it works. It generates one file and uh, it should be exactly the name of your uh, project file or your assembly name. And that's because I'm using web app six, uh, similar to my project name. And then you need to add styles.css. So if you want a different style for a different page, you just need to add another style and let's do this for index page index.cshtml.css and uh, let's choose the color green and let's run the project again so this time the index page uh, for each one tag has green color and in privacy page we have purple color and this is how you can use a CSS isolation feature in ES.NET Core 6. 
Thanks for watching.